Sometimes you want to help someone, but if they're different from you, it can be very hard. That's what happened to us today when a bird landed in a tree in our forest. I've never seen a bird like that before. Why is it visiting our forest? It probably came from the north and is flying south because winter's coming. That's called migrating. <laughs> Winters are warmer in the south. Uh-oh, look. Hmm. Oh, do you think the bird had an accident? What do we do? We could ask the bird if it needs help. Hello, hi, do you need help? I think we're scaring it. Mm. Time for a hop think. Question, how can we help the bird? We can't until the bird tells us what's wrong. Maybe it thinks we're angry because we're shouting at it. Let's get closer. Then we wouldn't have to shout to be heard. Let's do it. Hello, I'm Mouse. We want to help you. <laughs> It's not working. Hello? What you doing? Playing a game? No, we're trying to help this birdie, but it won't talk to us. Oh, maybe it doesn't understand talking. Try something else. Like talking like a bird. But bird talk sounds like singing. Thumbika, let's sing. Now? Right here? Sing what? What we want to say. Only instead of saying it, we'll sing it. Like this. <clears throat> Little bird, don't be afraid. We are friends and we want to help. Can you tell us what is wrong? We can't help if we don't know. I think it's working. Tell us, tell us, tell us. <clears throat> You must learn, I'm a turn, and I live far away. I came forth from the north, where it snows all day. Oh. But snow and ice isn't nice, so I could not stay. And I was on my way to the south today. I was high in the sky, but the winds were strong. I was tossed, I was lost, everything went wrong. Silly me hit this tree, now I can't go on. Cannot fly far or long with these feathers gone. Kio, let Tommy sing to you, hello. I need help, yes that is so. A sad story, yes, I know. And that's the tale of Tommy Turn. Thank you all for your concern. Thorny horns, that's an awful, oopsie. I forgot I have to sing. Thorny horns, that's an awful story. But I think that you are very brave. What I am is very thirsty. Is there water I can drink? Yeah! We're Amber, Coral, Keith, and Pearl. Each one of us is a Gibble Goose girl. We live at the pond not far away. So come and drink with us today. Edwina, Thunder, Rabbit here. And you must be Mouse, that much is clear. I'll give Tommy, we have to do something to help him go south for the winter. But what do we know about flying? We need a hop think with everybody, including Tommy. Sing a hop think? I guess it would help Tommy. It might be fun. Skip. Skip. Yeah, let's do it. You're welcome to join in our hop think. And come up with different ideas. Then we'll discuss each suggestion. Until the best answer appears. Why don't you stay for the winter? We'll help make it cozy and fun. <laughs> that 
not so kind, but I must keep my grading. It's my nature to follow the sun. Could Rabbit make a new invention to help Tommy fly through the sky? Thumbika, I think that's the answer. But I'll need things to use when I try. Why don't we all go collecting to find things the rabbit can use? <laughs> all right. Meanwhile, Tommy, you make yourself comfy. Have a bite, have a drink, have a snooze. Come on, let's go. Anything? Only reeds. Reeds look like feathers. Thumpika. Hey. Oh, oh. I found bark. I found moss. Thumpika. Thumpika. Must do finding. Ooh, Tommy's feathers. How sad. I wouldn't want to lose my feathers. Of course. I don't have any feathers, but if I did, I wouldn't want to lose them. Must do finding. Must do finding. Poor Tommy. He must be so worried he can't migrate. And he must feel lonely. Everything is so different for him here. Maybe we should remind him that we're his friends. When you're sad and afraid and you feel all alone With problems that don't seem to end Look around, you will find you're not on your own Not as long as you've got a good friend We'll stand by your side to help and to guide On your friends, you can depend we will be there to care and share, so remember you have friends. Remember you have friends. We're back! Hey, guys. I have vines. We have wreaths. I couldn't find anything. We have enough. I wish I had found something. We can use birch bark to fill the space. Tie it with a vine to hold it in place. It's tight and it's stiff and it will not bend. This won't work for my wing to mend. Oh, sorry it's too tight. Oh, what a funny sight. Oh, 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 need an idea bright. Won't give up till we get it right. Let's see what happens with this piece of moss. It's much too light and the wind will toss. What about these reeds if we tie them on? Trouble is reeds are not that strong. Oh, moss is much too light. Oh, what a funny sight. Oh, 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 we need an idea bright. Won't give up till we get it right. Won't give up till we get it right. <laughs> oh, toot my horn. I've got it! Follow me! Stay with Tommy so he doesn't feel alone. Okay. Look! Use these. They'll make good feathers because they are feathers. We could tie them back on Tommy's wing. Thumpika! Oh, <laughs> uh, I mean, Thumpika! <laughs> 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 it's working! You tied the feathers so tight they're staying in place! Well done, Thunder! See me soar like before, wings are strong and straight, didn't fall, thank you all. Now I won't be late, what you have done, everyone, I appreciate. Goodbye. And thank you. Goodbye. Goodbye. 
Kee -kee -kee -kee. We'll stand by your side to help and to guide on your friends. You can depend. We will be there to care and share. So remember, you have friends. Remember, you have friends. Oh, hi. Have you ever had a difficult problem that you didn't know how to solve? Sometimes, remembering how you solved other problems can be a big help. That's how we helped Hazel today when she had a great big problem. <laughs> it's getting cold. Yep. <laughs> what was that? Over there. Oh, oh no! Hazel's acorns! Wow! Quivering whiskers! All the snow and ice made the branch so heavy, it fell. And Hazel's acorns are bouncing all over the place. Hazel put those acorns there so she would have food for the winter. What do we do? We need to tell her. Come on. Hazel! Hazel, wake up! Hi, what you doing? We're trying to wake Hazel up. Oh. I do waking. Uh. Ah! Like an acorn! I'm awake! I'm awake! Stop thumping already! Hazel, quick! You have to come with us! <gasps> this is bad! Bad! More than bad! This is a disaster! A catastrophe! All summer and fall I collect acorns to eat in the winter, and now they're gone. But they're still here. They're just under the snow. But how will we find them? They must be scattered everywhere! You may be standing on one right now. Oops. We'll help you find them, Hazel. But how? Time for a hop thing. Hmm. Question. How can we find Hazel's acorns? Rabbit and I saw lots of them fall around here near the tree. We can't dig up all this snow. There's too much. Maybe we could blow it away. Whoa! Oh. Oops. Sorry. <laughs> There's too much snow to move. What we need is a great big carrot-tastic idea. But we can do it. Remember last summer when a tree fell on Rabbit's sleeping hole and Rabbit couldn't get in? I want to sleep in my own cozy, warm, dark, dry, safe, quiet sleeping hole. But this big thing's in the way, and I can't think of how to move it. I'm so tired, I can't think of anything. It's a good thing you weren't inside your sleeping hole when the tree fell down. How would you have gotten out? Easy. I would have just dug a new way out. Quick, it what? acorns, that's it! What's it? Instead of trying to move the great big tree that's blocking the way into your sleeping hole, why don't you just dig a new way in? Thumbika, that's it! I'll dig a new way in! Yeah! And we can help! With all of us digging, Rabbit soon had a new tunnel down to his sleeping hole. <laughs> and I finally got to sleep. I sleep so much better under the ground. That's what we have to do here. We have to tunnel under the snow. How? We're all too big. I'm not. In winter, mice tunnel under the snow all the time. Thumpika, that's it. Mouse can burrow under the snow and find the acorns. Thorny horns. That'll take all winter. No, it won't. Mouse can take these twigs with him, and when he finds an acorn, he can push the twig up through the snow, so we'll know where they are. That's a carrot-tastic idea. Let's, Let's do, do it! it. <laughs> oh, there's one. hip hop a -roo. <laughs> we'll toot my horn. Ooh! <laughs> Easy! Up! Go up! Hmm. <laughs> Something's tickling my foot. <laughs> oh, sorry, Mouse! 
Breakfast, lunch, dinner, breakfast, lunch, dinner, oh. breakfast, lunch, dinner. Remembering what we did before really helped us find Hazel's acorns. I just hope we found enough. Another day, another day, and five on my birthday. And, uh-oh. What's wrong? Uh, uh, we didn't find enough to last me all through winter. That's because a lot of your acorns hit this branch and bounced really far. I can't tunnel under the whole forest. I'm tunneled out. We need another caratastic idea. I don't mean to be upset. Not after you've all helped me so much. That's okay, Hazel. We all get upset. I got really upset when I lost Mossy, remember? You didn't lose Mossy, Mouse. <laughs> I did. I flipped it on my flipper and none of us could find it. Problem is that Mossy is lost. What can we do? We tried following Flippy stuff. That didn't work. So then we looked in the grass and in the forest, and now we're back here. Oh, it's all too much! Hmm. Are you sure you looked everywhere, high and low? Thumpika! That's it! We looked low, now we need to look high. Mouse, look where you're sitting. Huh? He's on the flipper. You don't mean... Yes! We'll flip you, Mouse. That way you can look around from way up there. And see where Mossy landed. Flip me? Flip me? Ooh, that sounds like... Ah! Don't worry, Mouse. I'll catch you. <laughs> Mossy! I saw Mossy. He's up in the tree. <laughs> if we hadn't flipped Mouse up on the flipper, we'd still be looking for Mossy. Maybe we could do something like that now. Uh, flip Mouse? No, but flipping me in the same way we flipped Mossy worked. So maybe if we drop these acorns on the branch... In the same way the acorns dropped before, we'll know where they bounced. You want to drop my acorns? I don't think so. We could lose them too. No, we won't, Hazel. It's not snowing anymore. We'll see the holes they make. You need to find more acorns, don't you? Well, if it's the only way... Carrot-tastic! Ready! Ready! Ready. I see it. Uh, got it. And I found two more. Wondrous whiskers. This is gonna work. Uh-oh. <laughs> we came up with this great idea because we remembered what we did before. Maybe now we'll have enough acorns. Almost enough, but not quite. We still need to find a few more. We saw some roll down the hill. Let's look there. Okay. Last one to the bottom of the hill is, uh, uh, uh the last one to the bottom of the hill. <laughs> <laughs> I can't tunnel here. The ground is too bumpy. Nothing. They could have rolled anywhere. I think I'm all out of caratastic ideas. Maybe we should take a hop stop. We all need a break. Good. I'm going to roll up a snow thunder. <laughs> How can we take a hop stop? It's really important to find my acorns. Remember last spring when we were stuck in the mud? It was really important to get unstuck. But we took a hop stop then. Hazel isn't here. Maybe she'd hear us. Hazel's probably in a tree collecting acorns for the winter. We could sing! How will singing get us out of the mud? Uh, I don't know. But it's fun, and I don't have any more ideas. Maybe Thunder's right. Sometimes it's good to take a hop stop. It helps you get new ideas. We, we are, are stuck, stuck. <sighs> out of luck <sighs> in the mud. In a puddle, in the middle of a river Mouse's whiskers are a quiver With no one near Who can hear If we all call out loud and clear? You see? 
Hop stops are fun. And then you think of good ideas afterwards. Yes. <laughs> we did get out of the mud. Maybe a hop stop is a good idea. We could all help Thunder with his snow thunder. Cool. Okay. What's that? A pine cone. How did that get there? It must have been buried in the snow. And it got stuck in the snowball when Thunder rolled over it. <gasps> buried in the snow. Just like my acorns. That's how we'll find them. <laughs> Roll it over there. Push. Not too fast. Told you hop stops were good. Look. Remembering things we did before really helped us come up with carrot-tastic ideas to find Hazel's acorns. And because we worked together and didn't give up, Hazel has plenty to eat all winter. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 oh